Hi there, this video is going to go over how to swap out content in a custom coded tabbed section of the website. So if you look down into CR rooms, you'll see a custom tab swap. If we preview, you can see content and images change. And when you look at your editor, everything's layered on top of each other. So it's difficult to intuitively see and understand how to change this out. These are layers and we want to make sure we isolate the layer that we're changing. So you have to do two things to get access to this section. First thing you have to do is turn on dev mode. You'll see code pops up, page code over here. We don't need this code if you want to look down through the code here feel free second thing we need to do is turn on our, turn on the tools layer or the layer uh, window I should say drag that over here three sections every page has this layers window as an aside so if for example you're searching for an element that you think is hidden and causing issues you can turn on the layers window and search for it that way. It has a lot of other uses as well. But we're gonna jump into the page layer, our CR rooms section, into the column, and then the box here. And you can see that you can spotlight and you can hide. To edit these, we have to hide all of the other layers. So if we want to edit the cherry room layer, we're going to hide all of the other ones. And you can see Cherry Blossom Room is now displaying on its own. You can change the text inside of the element. You can manage media in the gallery. You can change settings on the gallery. For example, what happens when you click and we'll wait for my computer to catch up here. Different overlays and icons, button styles, scroll animations, all kinds of settings that you just normally would inside of a inside of a gallery. You can also change whether or not a load more button is used and what happens when that's clicked. And then of course, after you make the changes, always wanna make sure we unhide all of those other boxes and save and publish, though I won't do that here as we didn't make any changes. You also kind of take this to the next step and start to understand that you can add other objects to this container and these uh, swapped tabs. You just want to make sure that anything you add is inside of the container box that is called hashtag box cherry or whatever room it's associated with. Uh, if it's inside that box, if it's attached to that container, it'll uh, appropriately display and hide based on the selected room up top here. That's it. Any questions, uh, email us uh, or call 888-249-8633.